Hey guys, welcome back to Geek Smart. Uh, I know it's been a little while since I've done a video, but I thought with a lot more people actually getting one of the Echo Dots, maybe this Christmas or this whole holiday season because of the prices that they've been at, I thought this year I might as well do a full setup video on the Echo Dot. Now this is going to pertain to any of the Echo products actually. I'm just doing it on the Dot because that's obviously the most popular right now because of the price. So uh, what you got in the packaging, if you got one, is the Echo Dot itself. Uh, US micro USB cable and USB plug-in adapter. Um, what we're gonna do is actually just go ahead and plug this directly into the wall and then the USB cable obviously into the back of the Echo Dot and get it booting up. So that's kind of first step. All right, so we got it in the wall. I'm gonna go ahead and just Plug it in, and here in a moment it, the ring's going to start showing that it's alive and it's starting to boot up. There's the blue light. So while it's doing that, uh, what you're going to want to do is on a mobile device, whether it's a tablet or a phone, it doesn't matter. I have the iPhone 10, Android, it doesn't matter which device. You're going to want to go into your app store and download the Alexa app, the Amazon Alexa app. If you just search Amazon Alexa or just Alexa, it's probably going to be the top one on the list. So she's booting up. Hello. Your Amazon Echo Dot is ready for setup. Just follow the instructions in your Alexa app. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So I've downloaded the Alexa app. It's that little blue app there. Now they have, may have changed it. Originally it used to be called the Echo app, but that doesn't matter. Uh, I had the, Echo, the Alexa app downloaded. Obviously my Echo Dot is ready for setup. So let's bring it in so you can actually physically see what I'm doing in the software side. And we'll go from there. All right, so here's my phone. I have the Amazon Alexa app, which I'm going to now open. And this is what the app looks like when you start up. This basically has you sign in with your uh, Amazon account. If you don't have an Amazon account, we're going to do a create a new account. Now, most people have an Amazon account. Let's just be honest about it. Um, either way, if we let's say if we hit, if we hit create new account, it's going to have you put in your name, your email address, and create a password for your account. If you have an account, obviously it's already going to be set up for that. You just put in your email address and your password and go from there. So I'm going to go ahead and put that my information in real quick. Now, upon entering your email address, password, and hit enter, it may come back to this. You may have to re-enter your password and uh, a challenge question or a recapture question, basically proving you're not a bot. Uh, and then just basically typing that in there along with your password, which I'm going to do now, and then sign in again. All right, so I seem to have gone through as it slowly logs into my Amazon account and uh, after this it'll kind of walk us through the next step so depending on uh, your connection or whatever it's setting up it may take a few moments so there we are welcome to Alexa tells you all the uh, information about that uh, contending you are agreeing to Amazon's conditions obviously if you haven't done this you may want to read into that I already have done it before so continue make sure it actually clicked and there we go. Now, what device are we setting up? We're going to set up the Echo Dot. So I'm going to click on the Echo Dot. Now, I have an iPhone. I'm probably going to have to connect a Wi-Fi to it for it to do it. But let's find out here as it goes along. Just keep tapping it so it doesn't sleep on us. Tell you what, when it comes back, I'll come back. I wasn't very much longer. But anyway, choose language. I'm, I'm U.S. English. i continue. Uh, so let's get your connected to Wi-Fi. Connect to Wi-Fi. So is my ring glowing orange? You can see that in the top of the video. Yes, it is. Make sure you're echoed out. Okay, excellent. Now I had to connect my iPhone to that. So I'm gonna swipe up and hold and get over to the settings app. Connect to the Wi-Fi. So go to Wi-Fi and there's the Amazon TR9 in my case, but it's gonna be Amazon whatever it is. I'm gonna wait for that to connect to make sure it actually connects properly. You've connected to Echo Dot. And there we are. So go ahead and up. finish the setup in your Alexa app. So we're going to go back to the Alexa app. So head back to the app. We are now connected to the Echo Dot. Hit continue. Select my Wi-Fi network. Mine is my last name here. Now I get to put password in. Let me do that real quick. So after I put my password in, I hit connect. And now it's connecting directly to my Wi-Fi. So it's not, connect, it's not going to be connected directly to my phone after this step is complete. And that's essentially what we're doing now is getting it connected directly to the router. All right, we'll give it a few moments. 
Okay, so now it says setup is complete. Echo Dot is now connected to Wi-Fi. We'll hit continue. How are we going to use our Echo Dot? Uh, we're not going to. In my case, I'm not going to connect it to any other additional speaker. If you're going to connect via Bluetooth to a different speaker or audio cable, so hardwire to a different speaker or audio system, you can do that. I'm going to hit no for now. You can always come back to this. Introducing a new way together. Okay, fantastic. I'm Brian Schuster. That's me. Give Amazon permissions. Uh, sure, why not? Okay. And that's basically so it can actually read your contacts and your phone and stuff. Verify your phone number so you'll actually put in your cell phone number here. Let me do that real quick. Set up phase, it'll actually send you a code, a uh, text message with a code in it, and you'll actually re enter that code. So let me do that real quick. Okay, now once you're done with that, you can watch a video, which basically your introduction to Echo, which I don't really need to because I already know the Echo, but it's going to tell you all about the information on that. Uh, and now we're just waiting for everything to get booted up and ready. And, or maybe actually maybe you have to watch it. There you go. You have to watch it. All right, so I, I watched it. Let's pretend. Hit next. And now you give it a try. Alexa. What's the weather like? In Dubuque, it's 31 degrees with cloudy skies. Tonight, you can look for cloudy skies moving in and out with a low of 14 degrees. Ah, oh, lovely night. So now, hit next here. Tells you about playing music. Tells you about what questions you can answer. Go to home. And now we are fully set up and we can actually start adding in more features. So I'm not going to go into that. This is just a setup video. But at least now you see how easy it is to actually set up an Echo or an Echo Dot. So it it's pretty simple. It really is. The, the app really walks you through step by step. Now, if you're on an Android device, you shouldn't have to go back out, go to settings, connect to Wi-Fi. After you connect it, then go back into the app. Uh, that's just a security protocol within iOS or on iPhone or Apple devices in general. But that said, guys, it's, it's really not that hard to do. And whether or not you needed this video... If you do, maybe it just helps you, at least gives you support to see how it actually happens. Um, now, if in the chance that you may not need this, or you tr you set it up and you don't enjoy it, maybe you want to switch over to Google's products instead, and you want to actually reset this and get all your information before you actually take it back, all you got to do is hold the mute and the volume down button at basically at the same time, just hold it. Eventually what's going to happen is the ring is going to glow orange here in just a few seconds. It should, if, if I'm doing it right. There's orange. Keep holding it. Don't let go. Eventually it's going to glow blue, and that's what we're waiting for, for it to glow blue. There we are. And then I'm going to release. That's a full factory reset. It's going to wipe everything off this body. Um, and then when you actually, when it actually restarts, it'll set up, it'll start up just like it did the first time we started it up. Say, hey, hello. I'm ready to set up in the Alexa app, and you'll hear it here in a second. But whether or not that pertains to you or not, may or may not be handy. Just want to at least let you know and show you that, because that's how I did this setup video, is I wanted to wipe it clean and start a fresh Amazon account and show you a fresh setup. So that is the Echo Dot. That is how you set it up. I love these products. I really do. I also have the Google Home Mini, um, and I'm going to be doing a setup video on that as well. But between the two, they're both fantastic. If you have any other questions, please comment below. Check us over on Tech Gooch where I do have uh, reviews on this guy as well as comparison, a little comparison video between this and the whole mini, at least my initial thoughts on it. I'm probably going to do another comparison video now that I have a lot more hands-on use with it. Ah, uh, look at that. So, with that said, guys, thanks for checking us out. Hello. Let me know what you think. Your Amazon Echo Dot is ready for setup. Sorry. Just follow the instructions in your Alexa app. There we are. But yes, please subscribe. Please share the video. Please like. And if you have anything else that you need help with, either here or over on Tech Gooch. That's our two tech, my, my two technology channels. But uh, I will post a card to these videos as well on these products. But any other questions, let me know. Otherwise, we'll see you on a future setup.